being fired on the front page of the, the Wall Street Journal, I mean, look, you can be embarrassed and let it really kill you, or you can say, score, front page of the journal. Amazing. <laughs> Another thing that we've talked about over the years is that high-performing women coming into their first or second jobs see it as a continuation of school. I know. What's wrong with so that? Good we're so A's. good at school. We're so good at school, and school seems so fair. Well, it's and comforting. Yes, you it's, know what the rules I, I are. I know the rules are. We're in a double bind as women because, of course, we are um, punished for bragging. Um, we are pushed back if we're seen to be seeking attention or power. And so as with so much in the, in the traditional workplace, we have to walk that fine line of how do you make it known but not be seen as obnoxious and aggressive. It's a very fine line. What for you was that wake up moment about the fact that there was so much imbalance either in the workplace or on Wall Street. It really was the financial crisis that opened my eyes, but finally looked around and said, the very fact that I made it doesn't mean it's doable and doesn't mean that business is a meritocracy and doesn't mean that it's a level playing field. And I didn't happen to have to have Harvey Weinstein go through that office in order to be successful. I happened to work for some terrific bosses. I always say, I also didn't happen to work for Steve. Steve is a super nice guy. Steve has a daughter. Steve went to unconscious bias training. <laughs> Steve is in middle management. Steve hasn't promoted a woman or person of color or other minority in years. And everybody likes Steve. And of course, we as women sit there and say, ah, oh, why didn't I get the promotion, right? And I don't wanna say Steve is biased. What I'll say is Steve has been socialized, you know, in our society. Right? And so Steve, when he thinks of the right person for the promotion, he tends to think of a, a white man. And so I didn't work for Steve or any of those others. What is very interesting about my career is that I also got fired twice. And so while I had bosses who said, go, 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 I also had bosses that said, stop, 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 stop. Right. right. And my success and failure, I think, were two sides of the same coin. And, and your, your firings were quite public because of the level at which yes. you were at at the time. Yes, I remember that. Thank you for bringing it up. <laughs>